All right. Hello, carpet cleaning world. This is Roger Lloyd, and this is Saturday Night Fever. <laughs> Tonight, we're going to talk about something very crucial and very important. I know you guys like to talk about equipment, so I try to talk about that to keep you guys interested. I know you like to talk about cleaning agents, especially right now with 50 million different new agents on the market. But I always tell you, and as you see behind me, I always try to speak to you and tell you about the marketing. Because listen, over and over again I tell you this. If you keep putting the cart before the horse by buying equipment, by buying cleaning agents, and then figuring, okay, well now I had the equipment, now I got some good product, now I'll try to get work. Well, you're putting the cart before the horse. And every time you do that, you're going to get yourself in a bind, and I want to race you each and every time. Because I know you're not going anywhere. But with that being said, let's move on to tonight's topic. It's very important. It's basic, but it's very important. And just maybe a few of you deep down inside in places you don't want to talk about, you may admit that you didn't think about this. The power of your company is one thing and one thing only. And it's not the equipment. It's not the truck mount. It's not the portable. It's none of that. It's not even really the amount of money that you have. The power of your company is your clients. Is your clients. Do you understand that? Listen. If you go out of business or decide to sell your business today or tomorrow... Do you know what one of the main things people are going to want to know is? Well, how many clients do you have? Oh, well, um, um, I think I got like a few hundred or maybe about a thousand. That's sad. You need to have a powerful list. What kind of list? Not a client list. A, po a powerful list email list. And how do I get that, Roger? Well, I'm glad you asked. Now, you know I always talk about, you know, you um targeting in the 10-mile radius of where you live or where your office or your business is based out of. So, what you want to do is, you know people, you have neighbors, you have friends, you have businesses that you deal with in that area. So what you want to do is you want to always constantly ask someone not to write down, but can they text you or can they email you from their phone or can they text you their email address from their phone? Then you want to go to your, your email account and you want to make a a client, well, I call it a client base. You want to make a very special list, a, a client list just for emails. And this will have all your contacts, everyone in the area that you come across, everyone that you meet, every business that you target. Maybe you, um, your wife goes to a nail salon and you have to, um, take her and pick her up or you meet her there or whatever. You want, or you tell your wife, hey, honey, can you get the um, owner of the nail salon's email address? Oh, yeah, I can do it. All right, um, maybe you go to a dry cleaner's. Ask the dry cleaner, can you give them, get their email address? Everything you, every time you bump into someone in your 10 mile radius, you, even if you n barely know them, you want to get their email address. Now I'm going to tell you why. Once you get, I don't know, maybe about 20 names to put in your email address, 
Uh, hey, Joe, I can't read your comment right now. I don't know why I can't. Um, can anyone tell me what Joe's saying? Oh, well. All right. So, the thing is this, Joe. I will respond to it, buddy. I just can't see it in this uh, live video right now. But the thing is this. If you guys get at least about 20 names, and maybe you might be like, Hey, Roger, man, I got 20 names right now. Well, then go ahead and start building and constructing your email address. I mean, your email account. Your client email account. And I know you're going to be like, hey, Roger, man, I don't, yeah, you do. And then if you guys already have like House Call Pro, if you guys have Service Monster, if you guys already have a software with your clients in it, then add this to it. But you want this to be your base email, a customer base. Like th these are people that you may have cleaned for before, or maybe this is people you haven't cleaned for before. It doesn't matter. This is what's going to make you valuable and make your company sales worthy. So, but besides that, when like I was saying, when you get at least about 20 people, or if you have more, you want to start emailing them specials that you're running. I am getting ready to start selling a monthly email program that you will have all the text, all the copy that you will need every month to send everyone in your client base a monthly email message reminding them of you. So therefore, and yeah, you can use constant contact or you can get fancy and do all that. But I'm going to be honest with you, a lot of that's a waste of time. If you just send someone a two-paragraph, no more than that, quick email about a special that you're running. Remember, carpet cleaning is event-driven. So therefore, what do we have coming up next? We have Valentine's Day coming up next. We have President's Day coming up next. So you want to try to touch on things that are coming up in the events. So, real nice is Valentine's Day. A lot of times you want to send an email out and say, you know, Valentine's Day, this is my email for February to my clients, is I love my carpet month. So, for you, you can get your carpets clean and get so much off. You can get your furniture clean, you can get so much off, and then you can get a special $10 off of either our pet odor removal service, or you can get $10 off of our carpet protector service. This is I Love My Carpet Month at BioClean. Do you see what I'm saying? Do you understand what I'm saying? But the thing is, just like how you're watching this Facebook group grow, your own client database will grow. See, you want to start understanding that you want residual income. Residual income, of course, is money coming back in that you basically don't have to do anything for. So what I'm saying to you is you will have your new clients coming in every month, but you want to make sure that at the click of one button to your email account, to, I mean to your email customer database, that you're sending everyone your monthly special. Listen, therefore, you'll have so many calls coming in from your regular clients or your existing clients is the better terminology. And then you're acquiring all your new clients from your Facebook ads, your Google AdWords, your flyers, your EDDMs, whatever you got. You're attracting your new clients. But the base and the livelihood of any business is their client database. Do you understand anyone that has any knowledge or that will buy your company or whatever would want to know how many clients do you have in your database? This is important. And it's very easy. And it costs you nothing. You could bump into someone you could be in line at the grocery store and you could have someone in front of you. You could have your uniform shirt on or something like that. And you could just whip out a um a coupon card here. Let me show you. Let me show you one that I have right here to give you guys an idea. 
this works real nice. This works real nice. Give me a second here. All right. So here you have a, a my business card, or I call it my sales card. And as you can see, it says, is it time for a little pro professional carpet cleaning? And then it says, save $25 on your next carpet cleaning of three rooms or more and get one upholstered chair clean for free. Do you understand? Do you see that? See right there, they're already getting something. So what I'm going to ask them is, well, I would love to give you this card. All I ask for you, can you just give me your email address? Because we're always having some specials and things like that. And we're your neighborhood carpet cleaner. And it's not like spam or anything. We don't like email you every day or anything like that. We normally email you like once every month or every other month to just let you know what we have going on. And it's not a long drawn out email. But you need to know what we have to offer in case you need any of these services. And remember, you'll get saved $25 on your first carpet cleaning of three rooms or more. And you'll even get one upholstered chair clean for free. So how about it? So do you understand where I'm going with this? So they will give you, they will be happy to give you their email address. Oh, I know, I know. Here we go. I love it. Hey, Roger, man. I hear what you're saying, man. But how do I know that they not just going to give me any email address? How do I know? Okay, I'm glad you asked. Since you're a Doubting Thomas and you're so worried about get, um, getting an email address like it's going to cost you anything. The thing is this. You can ask them to give you your email address. You can show them this card here. And you tell them, once they give you their email address, you're going to give them a code that makes this card valid. But tell them the only way they can get the code to make this card valid is if they give you their email address. Okay, is that the answer to your question? You guys are killing me right now. I can't. Man, I'm giving you priceless information, and you guys are sitting here, Hey, Roger, man, how do I know they're going to give me the right email address? Well, yeah, it's always a chance you're taking, but so is, so is being in business for yourself. That's a chance you're taking, too. But the thing is, you're getting known in your target market. Now, another question that I was asked when I taught this at a seminar Hey, Roger, man, how do I know when they going to call me, man? When does it expire? They might hold that card for two, for six months, seven months. Um, let me think about that. Are you planning to go out of business anytime soon? Do you plan to be in business in six months? Do you plan to be in business in seven months? Oh, okay. So does it matter? Like, let's not get into all... Uh, the heapie jeepy and all the, the silly stuff. What we're trying to do is we're trying to think of creative, creative ways to advertise. Remember, someone's email address is like giving them their home address, except you don't have to hope that the mailman sends it to them. So, yes, I know. You're like, but Roger, how do you know that they not going to just think it's spam, man? Well, hmm. Let's ask you a question. Are you going to send them spam? Is the work that you do spam? I'll ask you a harder question. Are you spam? <laughs> all right, all right, that's enough. Listen, you have to understand the value of an email list. You know, you can say you want to cross venture with another business. Say you want to cross venture with a plumbing service. Say you want to cross because you want to start water damage or whatever. Say you want to cross venture with a um a daycare center. Say you want to cross venture with a God skies is the limits with a beauty salon. See now you have something to barter with. Cause if you say hi, Miss Johnson, I know you own um uh plush care uh doggy care 
And I was wondering if we could talk a little business. And she's going to be like, well, 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 okay, Roger, what are you talking about? Well, I own BioClean Carpet Care right here in the Pottstown area. And I wanted to know if we could talk a little business by bartering. And she's going to think that you're going to want some of her services for free. So you're going to have to hurry up and let her know that that's not what you want to barter about. What you want to know, if you give her your email database or, no, not give it to her, but if you if she gives you an ad that she wants to run to your database, then you can give her an ad that she can run to her database. So see, you cross-reference there. So I would put in my email for all clients of, of, of doggy daycare or whatever she owns, um, you get $25 off three rooms or more, and you get one upholstered chair clean for free as long as you mention when you call that you're calling from Daddy um, Doggy Care or whatever, and vice versa. She will send an email from me out to her clients saying that, um, um, you know, uh, bio, I read to you my, I read to you my, uh, so she would say, I'm sorry, wait a minute, let me get, I'm getting confused here. So I would send that email to her clients. She would send me an email to my clients introducing doggy daycare. And if they have any dogs that need any daycare, that she would offer them 10% off or whatever. You guys get where I'm going with this. So this is how it works. I mean, an email list is so powerful. Let me tell you how, how else an email list is so powerful. Listen, is everybody listening to this? Especially you guys here on the East Coast with me. Now, it's February. And it's still a whole nother cold 28, 29 days that we have to deal with. And maybe we might have to deal with some cold days in March too. But right now, we're trying to worry about getting through February. So, now, if you have this database, if you have this list, I just read to you my special for February. It's I Love My Carpet Month from BioClean. It's I Love My Carpet Month from whatever you're, wherever you are. Do you understand what I'm saying with this? So now you will let your clients know, like I will let them know, hey, um, uh, BioClean client, it's I Love My Carpet Month. And I want you to get the Roger Lloyd I Love My Carpet Month deal. Because we all know love is in the air. We want to be romantic on February 14th. But we want the house to smell good and feel good all, all month long. So why not get a good low moisture maintenance cleaning in the month of February for I Love My Carpet Month? And then you just put a, attach a couple pictures of the low moisture machine and then you let them know how low moisture won't wet up the house. There's no hoses to drag in from the truck mount or you don't have to lug in heavy duty portable equipment and fill it up and wet up the house. It's just enough to clean the carpets for I Love My Carpet Month. Now, if you guys want this email, I have it. It's $25 for the month, and I'll email it right over to you, and you just put your name, phone number, and your company in, and you send it to your database. Are you kidding me right now? Listen, you know, I give you a lot of good tips for free. You know, we have the Nexus Convention that's coming up in a matter of hours. We have the ICE Convention was coming up in a matter of days. And, of course, I want you guys to stop by and come see me, and um, we'll talk. And if you guys are from the carpet cleaning world, which is my group, this group right here, and you come see me, and you say one of my colloquialisms like, Hey, Roger, man. Or uh, what's another one? Are you kidding me right now? If you come and I actually know you, uh, know that you've been watching and you're a part of this group, I'll give you this email to send out to your target market for free. But that's only if you come up to me at the convention and you say one of my sayings right there. And of course, are you kidding me right now?
<laughs> Listen. It's 2018. It's the year of the vision. Where residual income should be your only decision. Well, you know what? I want to give you guys something else. You guys know I have my um line of cleaning agents. And I have a good client and friend and member here in the Carpet Cleaning World group. His name is Al. Everybody say hi to Al Saunders. Hey, Al. How you doing, buddy? Al asked me the other day. He said, hey, Roger, um... You know, I have um I I have all your OSRs, I have all your BioClean line of products, and he said, but Roger, do you have anything for like if I don't need a whole OSR job, like if I just need to like spray a couple spots to get up the urine or something like that? Well the answer is yes. Yes I do. And the also answer is also, Al, you already have it because you purchased it from me. Now we all know that um, CTI, Pro's Choice, they have a unique product, I, I loved it, um, called Molecular Modifier. And what this was, it had all the properties of an enzyme to remove all the like, you know, the, the little urine spots, just the little trickles, something you wouldn't need the OSR for. But... I have my line of scented OSRs, which you guys saw, and, you know, you really should get some. I have lavender, vanilla, and apple. So, I mean, you have your choices to really, if you have to use OSR for some major pet problems, you can get it in scents now, and it really works, and it's selling like hotcakes. So you need to make sure you get yours. It's $39.99 for a nine-pounder, and you can uh, get all three of them, and um, I'll give you a, um, my pet odor brochure absolutely um free with the uh three osrs if you purchase all three of them you need to think about that all right now talk getting back to the molecular modifier that cti pros choice mix now that's their product that they use for small little pp spots here and there well in my marketing package the middle package at uh and the most expensive, the top to bottom, or the BioClean package, as I call it, they offer deodorizers. But really, they're not just deodorizers, but in the carpet's, um, the client's mind, that's the way you have to say it. You can't tell your client, oh yeah, we use molecular modifier. They're going to be like, what? What? Are you kidding me right now? What, what, what did you just say to me? So no, we just tell them that we use scented deodorizers. But in these deodorizers on my BioClean line, they have the molecular modifier ingredient in it. So it actually will eat up the pet stains, the little pee pee stains. So yes, what I am saying to you is, with these products right here, my bio, sorry, here we go. My bio powder, which is baby powder, smells so good. And then my bio lemon, which is right here smells so good as well these are like molecular modifiers they will take care of all the little pet odors that are in the carpet so you don't have to worry about buying an extra pet odor product you have them right here you'll just want to tell your client if you purchase well if you bought my marketing package if you buy the middle package or the um the bio clean package which adds the um so you have these deodorizers, and in the BioClean package, which is your most expensive package, right here, the BioClean Kid Friendly Cleaner, the all-natural oxidizer, right here, if you put that in, well, I'd like to put that in, add that with the pre-spray. If you use those, now you'll be brightening up the carpet, but with those deodorizers, not only will you be making the carpet smell good, but they have that same ingredient to take care of those little pet pee pee problems. You know, the ones that aren't that bad, but they're sporadic. That will take care of that for you. Are you kidding me right now? Nope. Let me say it again. Nope. So, right here, you have everything you need. So, now, if you want to buy both of the deodorizers that I, hear, that I have here, they're $20 a piece. 
And what will happen is uh, $20 a piece plus shipping. And then what will happen is I will give you what piece of marketing. Da -da -da -da. Okay. I'll give you a professional carpet cleaning brochure. That's what I'll do. And my brochure is nice. I don't know if you guys saw it. My brochure is really nice just for um, just for introducing your carpet cleaning packages. So that I will do for you um, if you decide to purchase both of these uh, deodorizers, the Bio Lemon and the Bio Powder, which is baby powder. And um, I have a, a friend here that I want to thank. She may or may not be watching this. Um, she told me we should add lavender. So in the next month or so, when I get back from Vegas, we will be adding lavender scent to our line of molecular modifiers or the deodorizers that will also take care of the little pee-pee uh, smells and things like that that people are concerned about that are like normally like trinkles around the house. Remember, if they have real strong pet problems, you need the OSR. And remember, we have that in lavender, we have that in apple, and we have that in vanilla. That does matter. That does matter. I can't explain to you how my clients are definitely buying my pet odor treatment just because it's scented. Just because it's scented. They'll spend more money and buy that. And that's $29.99 additional per room. And they'll pay for that just because it's scented and it'll take care of the pet stings. But I know what you guys are saying, so here we go. Hey, Roger, man, but you just said your deodorizers take care of it. No, that's not what I said. I said they'll take care of the little PP stains here and there. But when you have heavy-duty pet odor, like where you have the heavy-duty yellow and brown and gold stains, you need my OSRs, which are scented. Lavender, apple, and vanilla. The deodorizers that I have here, Bio Lemon, Bio Powder, which is baby powder. And we're getting ready to add Bio Lab, which is lavender. And those are little, those also have the same properties as molecular modifier to break up the little pee pee smells and odors that you would go in that are sporadic, that you don't need the heavy duty for. And you still can charge a, a nicer um, price for that too. I mean, most guys, if they're doing rum pricing, they're getting, what, $10 a rum for a deodorizer? Well, with these scents, you can get $15 to $17 a rum for these deodorizers because they're not just deodorizers. They have the molecular modifier ingredient in it that'll eat up the little uronic stains. All right? So now, getting back to that, and I, gave, I know you guys like to talk shop, so I had to talk about chemicals a little bit. But getting back to the real purpose of this video, guys, start your email list today. Remember, you're trying to target everyone in a 10-mile radius. So I'll tell you what. I'll stay up. I'll do this for you. Ma. Now, you guys know I've got to get ready to go away to Vegas in a couple days, but I'm going to stay up for you. I'm going to stay up late just for you, just because I love you. I'm going to say, and I'm going to make another sales card that introduces you and offers them a special on their carpet cleaning if they give you their email address. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to have your email address or a place for you to put your email address on it. And then it says, if you email us, I want to get BioClean today, or whatever your company's name is, that's what I would say. If you email us, I want to get BioClean today, that's all they have to do is email, I want to get BioClean today. Because when they email you, they will automatically, you'll have their email address. Ding, 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 ding. If they email you, 
then you automatically will have their email address. Do you understand? You could just stand in front of a grocery store, man, and you could just hand these cards out. What was the other guy's name, Dion somebody, who told you he used to stand in front of the grocery stores and just hand out business cards all day? Well, no, I'm not just going to hand out business cards all day. But what I'm saying, if you got the time and you don't have no money to advertise any other way, that's an effective way. I wouldn't do it, but, I mean, why not? I would rather put some of the business cards on the little um bulletin boards in the um uh grocery stores or or something like that but don't get me wrong if i'm walking by someone and i see she has three kids and joey's like kicking her at the leg and the other baby's like pulling her pants like at the hip and she's trying to carry two bags at the same time and she's like joey get away from me and she's like bobby i'm gonna kill you you <laughs> you know what i'm saying right well i'm gonna give her i'm gonna stop and say oh first i'm gonna take a bag out of her hand i'm gonna say let me give you a hand man where's your car and then i'm gonna walk her to the car so she doesn't so she can deal with joey and tommy and then I'm going to say, you know what, ma'am? I want to give you this card. Maybe this will be valuable to you if you read it. All you have to do is email the back of this card. It gives you the email address right there. And if you email it and say you want to get BioClean, you can get some um, discounted carpet cleaning. Um, you know, so here you are. And she's going to say, oh, thank you. And she may or may not. But the thing is, that's why I try to tell them they get three, if they get three rooms clean. They'll get $25 off, and then if they get um, they get one upholstered chair clean for free. Now, I know what you guys are saying. Hey, Roger, man, I hear what you're saying, man. I like the whole thing with maybe the three rooms and the $25 off, but, I mean, a whole upholstered a chair, too? I mean, don't you think you're giving too much away? I know. I don't know if I could do that. Well, see, that's the problem. You haven't thought this out all the way yet. See, the law of reciprocity states, if I give you something, you feel obligated to reciprocate. That means to give back. So therefore, if I'm giving you, if I'm giving you the free chair, but first of all, you're going to clean that chair so well that the, you're in hope that you say, well, Miss Johnson, did you want to come look at this chair? We just finished it. Oh my God, Roger, look at that. It's so clean. It smells so good. I just can't. Oh my God. Well, Miss Johnson, you know why we're here. If you want that other lust, love seat and sofa done, I can do that for you for another $100, $99, and I can just clean it all up so you can have the carpet smelling good. You can have the chair smelling good. And I mean, you only spend what, a couple hundred dollars today? And you got a free room of carpet clean. So you came up pretty good today, Miss Johnson. Oh, Roger, you're so good. You're such a good salesman. Oh, my. All right, Roger, if you say so, go right on ahead. Just go ahead and clean it. <laughs> doesn't have to be brain surgery it doesn't have to be expensive people want what they want people want what they want people want a deal people want a deal if anyone feels like they're getting a deal then they're more apt to deal with you but it's important and it's imperative that you understand that you want to get that email address. I just gave you how many synopsis on how you can use it. But most of all, you're going to get old. You're going to get older. Take it from me. Take it from your boy, Roger Lloyd. I was young just like you. Look, look at that. Look at that. See that bio man behind me there? That was me 10 years ago. <laughs> yeah, right. I know. But the thing is this. It's 2018. It's the year of the vision. Where residual income should be your only decision. Hey now. This is Roger Lloyd. From the carpet cleaning world. And this is Saturday Night Fever. And tonight, the topic was the power of your email list. 
Keep in mind, you want to send your potential, uh, not your potential, but your existing clients and your potentials because you'll be getting all types of, uh, when you hand out the cards, you'll be getting all types of email addresses. So you want to send this list and email every month. So for the ones that haven't used you, will can keep you they'll, you'll keep being in their face and the ones that have used you will be reminded. And also, you don't understand. Maybe you want to run an upholstery cleaning special. Maybe you want to get into tile and grout. Maybe you want to get into air duct cleaning. Maybe you want to get into mattress cleaning. Maybe you need to send an email explaining the importance of carpet protector. Maybe you want to send an email about the importance of getting rid of the pet urine in their carpet so it doesn't discolor the carpet and wear out the fiber. Maybe you just want to send an email telling them how carpet is the second largest filter in their home and if it's not clean they will have sick building syndrome where they'll notice they'll have runny nose, watery eyes and and the pets and everybody will be sniffing and coughing, coughing, and they won't know where it's coming from. Well, it's because the carpet is a filter. And every time it's walked on and tracked on, the dust and the germs get redistributed back into the airflow. And so they need to get their carpets clean, not when it looks dirty, but when it starts to look dirty. So they don't wait. Because once the carpet looks dirty, it doesn't need to be cleaned anymore. It needs to be restored. So two things are going to happen that's going to benefit you. Either they're not going to listen and they're going to wait till the carpet looks so bad. Then they have to pay you more money for the restorative carpet cleaning process. Or they're going to get on a maintenance plan with you where they're going to keep the carpet up every four to six months. Whereas though... They're going to be paying you that way. But any way you look at it, they're going to be paying you more money to take care of one thing. And one thing only. The second largest filter in their home. Their carpet. This is Roger Lloyd. Thank you. And good night.